you know we what I'm don't. Saying? We don't. And I'm just thinking to myself in my head, bring on the water, Lord. Bring on the fire. Bring on the strong <laughs> wind. Because he said he comes Wipe back. all of hey, this look, away. This world is before going. We, before we get... Before we get to that, because that's just not, it I mean, it's just not they right. It's, it's got to happen. To catch a predator. And that show bang. I remember and that. You know, and you know what somebody, day, like, I know the person that's still oh. running that Charles Hansen stuff on YouTube. Yeah. It's a dude named Skeeter Jean. He still do that to catch a predator stuff on YouTube, YouTube to yeah. this day. That's always wild. He just hit it. And that's not just dark side. But I do feel like a lot of times they be pushing stuff. Because, like, I was just watching, um, Jenny and Georgia mm-hmm. is on Netflix, and just it, it's like the same thing with every teen show or just everything. Like, is you have a middle school kid, they out having sex, they doing drugs, and it just get more and more and more. And then it's like some of these actors they do be like of age, and some of them they really be like 16, 14, mm-hmm. 15. Like, y'all just out here having sex scenes, like. I do feel like they be pushing certain stuff. Sex mm-hmm. on these kids. That's what it's yeah, of. like it just be like y'all just pushing it, just trying to make it normal. Yeah. Like it, it, it the, is normal now, but it's like it should be world. like. That's why everybody yeah, like, oh yeah, I lost my virginity at 16, 12. Like it's like, bro, you have, you but you did that with try. a sixteen or twelve year old person. They got well, too much. Well, well, listen, it's not to say that we didn't do stuff, right? Right, right, we did stuff, but like, but not but to see, I had to actually work hard to do that. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? I, I wasn't just able to just freely do it. You know what I'm saying? And that's just the way that it is. It's just the wave. Like, listen, if you bought liquor at the liquor store, you had to go and get somebody that's to buy it for you. Yeah. Real talk. Like, you just had to do different things. You had to make the effort, and you had to go through a barrier to entry that basically at some point throughout that process, you had to reevaluate whether or not you was doing the right thing or if you was going to get caught, what the consequences was. Even skipping school, right? It was just like, listen, if I get caught... And my parents gonna know. Mm-hmm. And that phone call back when we was in Cast Tech, that phone, mm-hmm. that automated phone call is gonna call my house and say, "Yo, Anton this person is not was not in school there. right now." <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like I had to actually like evaluate: Do I really want to just take the chance? You know what I'm saying? But there is no barrier to entry anymore. Like yeah. it's just like it's there. Can do whatever it is that they want. It's an open door do. policy. <laughs> yeah, it's sad, but I hope I'm not here by the time this. You forget it. Hey, I, I think it's gonna be in the next years. It's, it's weird how they how they put high school in the media now. Now that you brought up that Jenny and Georgia stuff, like for the past five years, almost every major show has, that has been talked about in media has been in high school and has involved crazy, crazy mund- things like you will never see before, like Euphoria for a, like um, on my for yeah, example on my block. Yeah, on my block. Uh, what was the other one on Netflix where the um the too girl long. um committed suicide? Uh, oh, thirteen mm-hmm. reasons why. Yeah, thirteen yeah, reasons yeah, why. Too much. Like all of these shows See, are based in none of that shit. In school, are based in, in school, are based yes. in school. They even have a teen all shade American. room. Yeah, how do you they have a teen school, shade? Room? Why do you have a teen shade room? Yeah, all American. All American. They, they have all sex American like, right. in high school. Like, the, I saw that. They are good. That's my thing. Like, and Rita, you can substantiate this because. You know, my daughter is 14 now, but, you know, we've spent an extended amount of time with her as far as grooming her and all of this other type of stuff as parents, right? We do everything as a family. Did you homeschool her? No. Okay. Um, we didn't homeschool her. But the, here's the thing. Like, we, we look for shows to where we can just sit around as a family and just kicking it, right? Yeah. So we'll start with All-American. Mm-hmm. And first is a football, and oh man, he got a friend in school. It go way later. And then the friend, the friend, the friend is gay, which is cool. I ain't tripping about none of that, about right? Because cool. that's normal in those environments, which exactly is what I was talking about, mm-hmm. right? Is that you gonna have some friends? Dog, one of my best friends that was in high school was gay. Mm-hmm. A, Still a girl, <laughs> right? One of my homegirls, my one of my. It's some people that I work with that I will. Listen, I'm taking them over you 100% of the time, and they are openly gay. I ain't tripping off of that. Mm-hmm. That was just a part of that particular show, mm-hmm. right? And then it's just like over sex. Yep. Over sex. Mm-hmm. Over sex. Yeah, and I'm like, drugs. And, me, and I'm just looking. Violence. And even my daughter is like, yo, is that part even necessary? Right. right. Exactly. And it's just and like, that's... yo, what is? what are we doing here? The Flash. We sitting there watching The Flash. We thinking, okay, well, this is a nice family show. Me and my daughter could watch together. She's. What she was ten at the time or something like that, Mm-mm. and then it's just like, 
dang, uh, okay, Iris and the Flash got to start having a relationship now. And, and it's just like, what did that got to do with catching the, right. the water man over there? I just want to see him fight the water man. I'm not looking for the yeah. And what what I think what I think is crazy is too like even in the like the baby shows like the kids shows they mm-hmm. pushed him to have like a boyfriend girlfriend like mm-hmm. that's that's weird. Like I wouldn't have my little four year old saying like oh yeah that's your boyfriend. No, like all, if you look all of them like even the Lion they King have. like um, Simba and Nala they was boyfriend girlfriend yeah. they shared a kiss like it be like that leading up taste. to it. But is it? But would you watch your four-year-old daughter kissing another a little boy on the lips? I'm saying, but I mean, a lion. It was a lion. lion no, but I'm, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> it was a lion. I mean, I love that. I can't give this an example. Right. But you it, it, it's an example. I am over sexualization. Oh, God, I never never watched Pocahontas, <laughs> but even Bambi. Pocahontas, I mean, uh, we can is, leave. Uh, we can leave our I don't know about the I'm Disney saying, shows, but you four year had me thinking kidding. that every I high school was, was peddling movies. drugs right. on the international. The, no, they, they was not kitty movies. Except till you got the Shrek. You like this is for kids. The Aristocats. Look, look, hold up, y'all. <laughs> the Aristocats. Um, uh, Fern Gully. It, they the Aristocats was taught you how to be a good stepdaddy. <laughs> I'm not about to fuck. All I'm saying is, am I wrong? Who saw that movie? Thomas I O'Malley mean, was it's, an it's, incredible it's no stepfather. Limits. That's all I'm saying. And the book. It ain't no. It ain't no. Yes, ain't he no was. That's a cat, right? Yeah, the, the old dude. Yeah. yeah. If I listen <laughs> on Netflix and all of all of this, it's supposed to be censorship as far as like you can determine whether or not the person that's watching or the profile that it is is an mm-hmm. adult profile or a kid profile. I'm not saying too much of a difference between a kid profile and a. Dad. No, it's that's no, it's saying. no difference. Dang. That's all I'm saying is that it's not too much of a difference. And at this point, Except it's just nipples. absolutely insane. Except but what? Nipples. <laughs> nipples. That's the only difference. Is there anything that we can do? No. To change it, or is it just something that changes the community's mindset? No, I think Stop that. I think that, that. That's the only way. You know, I had I was interviewing Kwame Kilpatrick, right? And I think what's happening with the gay community, um, and it's just my opinion in particular, is the same thing that happened with women. It's the same thing that happened with black people. It's the same thing that happened across the board. What he said, in his opinion, specifically was, he said that what legislators and politicians realized in the 2000s, specifically during the Obama era, was the way in which they can tie a particular group to the party is by advocating for us, right? And so, for example, the agenda was to champion the gay community similar to getting behind women, similar to getting behind black people, Mm -hmm. because they know that black people on an epic clip is only going to vote one way, not based off of whatever the policies of the candidate is, but more or less voting across party lines. And so he said that what happens in other communities specifically, for example, you can go in Mexicans or whatever, they play both sides. They're, They're invested in finding out what candidates want because they're advocating for what the best thing is for them long term by having both sides come to them and then petition them Mm -hmm. for whatever it is that they need in order to get their vote. Mm -hmm. So what they did was they tied the gay community to the Democratic community. And this is just one instance, right? Because they knew that if they had tied tied them to that early by aligning them and saying that this is a liberal way of, of going about doing things, then they would never have to actually stand up and do anything for them going long term mm. because they automatically identified with a specific party. 